The S-500 Prometheus is Russia's advanced air and missile defense system designed to counter a wide array of aerial threats, including hypersonic missiles, intercontinental ballistic missiles, ICBMs, and low-Earth orbit satellites. Developed by the Almaz and Tay Air Defense Concern, it entered service in 2021 and is intended to supplement the S-400 system, not replace it. Key Features Extended Range The S-500 boasts an operational range of up to 600 kilometers for anti-ballistic missile ABM defense and 500 kilometers for air defense, surpassing the capabilities of its predecessors. Hypersonic Interception It is capable of intercepting targets traveling at speeds up to 7 kilometers per second, including hypersonic missiles and ICBM warheads. Multi-Target Engagement the system can detect and engage up to 10 ballistic and hypersonic targets simultaneously. High Altitude Capability The S-500 can engage targets at altitudes up to 200 kilometers, enabling it to counter threats in low Earth orbit. Wikipedia Advanced Missiles it utilizes the 77N6-N and 77N6-N1 missiles, designed for high-speed kinetic interception of advanced threats. Operational History The S-500 was first deployed in the Moscow region in October 2021. In 2024, it was stationed in Crimea to protect the Kerch Bridge amid escalating tensions with Ukraine. However, reports indicate that it was unsuccessful in intercepting Ukrainian-launched MGM-140 Atekmus missiles during this deployment. Strategic Significance The S-500 represents a significant advancement in Russia's air defense capabilities offering enhanced protection against a broader range of threats. Its ability to counter hypersonic missiles and space-based targets positions it as a critical component of Russia's integrated air and missile defense strategy. As of now, the S-500 Prometheus air defense system is exclusively operated by Russia, which developed and deployed it. The system entered service in 2021 and is currently stationed in the Moscow region. In June 2024, Russia relocated components of the S-500 to occupied Crimea for experimental deployment amid escalating Ukrainian missile strikes. Russia has proposed joint production of the S-500 to India, and India is considered a potential first foreign buyer. However, no confirmed export orders have been finalized yet. China is also identified as a prospective customer, but like India, it has not yet received or deployed the S-500 in summary. The S-500 is currently in active service only with Russia, with potential future deployments or joint production arrangements under discussion with countries like India and China. Thank you for watching. Please do subscribe, like, share, and comment. Namaskara, Madhusudan.